Hey, I didn't know you were here. Ah, Saturday morning. Good morning. Well, you can see I'm still in bed. Nice and cozy under my blankets. It's 12 degrees outside, so I don't really feel like getting up. But uh, I got to get motivated. I got to get out of this bed. Today is week, well, week five actually of my weigh-in. So I got to do that. I got to weigh myself and see how I did compared to last week. Last week I only lost like four tenths of a pound. This week wasn't much better. I'm telling you, be honest, this week wasn't much better at all. So uh, I don't know. I don't know what it's going to be like. But I got to get up. I'm going to go get on the treadmill. I need to shave. I'm looking pretty rough, guys. I need to shave my head. I need to be balder than I already am. So, with that said, I'm going to try to find the motivation to get myself out of this nice warm bed, I think. I don't know. I might just roll over and go back to sleep. Another reason I can't get out of bed right here this big guy just came in and flopped right on top of me wanted to give me some Saturday morning loving huh how am I supposed to get up now it's got to be one of the most lovable cats we've ever had All right, well, I'm gonna go get on the treadmill and uh, get myself moving for the day. It's almost, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning and I'm just now getting out of bed. So let's, uh, let's get myself motivated. I know if I get on the treadmill, get the blood flowing, I'll feel a lot better. And uh, then I'm gonna do my way in. So let's go jump on that treadmill. Okay, well, I'm on the treadmill my week this week five for me and uh it hasn't been a very good five weeks not like last year last year i was a lot more motivated last year and uh <clears throat> excuse me this year i just the weight is coming off very slow and i'm not doing the exercise like i was doing last year my eating isn't that bad this year i'm actually eating fairly well I'm not eating fast food. I'm only eating, eating out maybe once or twice a week, and that's on the weekends. Those are my cheat days, I guess. And even then, I'm not eating really bad foods. I'm, chill, I'm still drinking water. Um, I'm not eating desserts. I'm not eating fried foods. So I'm not doing horrible, but I'm not, I'm kind of just stagnant. I'm just kind of staying the same. And it's been some really crazy weeks. Uh, with sickness going around, I haven't felt well. Been crazy busy at work. It just it just seems like there's a lot going on, and I know we all all of all of us got a lot going on. It's not just here; it's everywhere. So, I really don't have an excuse. I know we like to use excuses when we don't do what we think we should be doing, but um, I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep on pushing. I'm going to keep trying to do a little bit more. And today, I got, you know, I woke up early this morning. I woke up at 7.30 this morning. And I started just watching YouTube videos in bed, trying to get caught up on everybody's videos. And one video that I watched, Cheryl and Family, her, her newest, well, I don't know if it's her new, I think it's her newest video. Time to rise and shine. Where are you at? 
Where are you at? There he is. Time to rise and shine, Ryan. Hi guys, and welcome back to another vlog. It's gonna be a gorgeous day here in Texas. The sun is out. It's gonna warm up today, and it won't happen until about lunchtime, but it will happen. I just got done waking everybody up. It's time to get this day started. So Ryan is in the shower getting ready. I am getting ready to make myself a healthy breakfast. Breakfast is served. And she was so upbeat, motivated, and she'd been on the healthy journey as, just like we are. And she seemed to be eating well, you know, exercising and, do and doing a good job and just had the right attitude. And uh, I wanted to know if that's contagious. I need some of that. So after I'd commented on her video, she sent me a request on the Fitbit challenge for the weekend, we have a work weekend challenge, step challenge. So maybe that was her little way of trying to help me get motivated. So thanks Cheryl from Cheryl and Family for, for the video and for also always being so active on the Fitbit. You've been doing really good this year. I've been struggling bad. I've been either last every week or close to last. So I'm embarrassing myself. I'm going to try to see if I can have a decent showing this weekend at least. But anyway, um, today after I get off the treadmill, I need to take a shower, I need to shave, I need to get, get all this hair off my head and get back to my Mr. Clean Baldness. And then I've got to be in my wife, we're gonna, we have to go out. My son, my youngest son, Aiden, who's eight years old, he got invited to go to the West Virginia Mountaineer basketball game against Kansas State today with a buddy of his and his parent, their parents. So we're gonna go get him a, he doesn't have a West Virginia shirt. And uh, he definitely doesn't have a Kansas State shirt either, Keith, so I know what you're thinking. So we're gonna go out and get him a little West Virginia shirt so he'll be ready for the game. And then once he goes to the game, uh, me and my wife, we might get into something, maybe go out shopping or we have to go to Sam's Club, I think. And uh, I know, I'm talking about exercising and losing weight and eating right. But it's Saturday and it is my cheat day Hopefully I haven't gained any weight from last week and I can cheat a little bit. So, you know, we don't get to do a whole lot together, especially through the week because we're working, both of us full time. So on Saturday, we like to at least to go out to eat together. So we'll probably go out to eat after he goes to the game and I might show you, show you my cheat meal. I'll show you, it's not too bad. I don't know where we're going yet, but I'll keep you guys, keep, you guys will keep me accountable and I won't, I'll try not, well, yeah, I'll try not to order anything really bad. So that's about it. I'm going to get off this treadmill in a minute. Well, I'm playing about 20 minutes to 30 minutes. I'm going to go weigh myself, and then uh, I'll show you that, and then we'll go on from there. So we'll see you here in a minute. Okay. Wasted enough time this morning, and it's time to weigh in. So let's see what week number five weigh in has in store. Last week I was 256.4. Looks like I'm 255.3. Let me double check that. Yep, 255.3. So it was a loss. It was actually what? That is 1.1 pounds for the week. Not bad. Well, there you have it, guys. I lost a little over a pound for this week's weigh-in. And it's also my cheat day. So what do I do after I lose a pound? I go eat. So it's also my cheat day. So we're on our way to TGIF Fridays to celebrate our cheat day and my loss of one pound. Hope I don't gain it all back. What are we gonna get? What are you gonna get? I don't know. 
I'm thinking about getting in the sizzling chicken and cheese. It's a 1160 calories. Is that a lot? What are you laughing about? Because I don't have to worry about calories. Well, I haven't ate today, so I have 2,000 calories. Got my oh, I, oh, I, <laughs> we got Code Zero here. Love Code Zero. It's hard to find that. Alright. First thing we got was an appetizer, guys. Check this out. Like pretzel sticks with some cheese and bacon in it. Probably pretty fattening. But I'm just going to eat a little piece of it. Mainly Brennan's going to eat this. Pretzels. Yeah, how are the pretzels? Uh, pretzels. Uh, tasted good. Thumbs up on the pretzels? Yeah. Would you get for Good thing you got to eat at least half one. Would you order? Yeah, right. Yeah, why'd you eat them all? I only had half of one, guys. Yeah. Don't listen to these. Don't yeah, listen to them. We had half. Yeah, you had half of what? Half of Half of all of it. He had half, I had the other half, and you had the rest. <laughs> okay. I had half of one stick. Maybe a quarter of a stick, is it? More than that. Huh? You had like two sticks. You had like three. No, uh, I didn't. But when I've got for dinner play, when you see that, I kind of cheated a little bit more than I should have probably. We'll see. Brendan did good. He got the grilled salmon, right? That's what I should be getting. Yeah. I don't know where our food's at, and I'm getting pretty hungry. Why don't you go back in the kitchen and see what's going on? I'll go have a talk. Yeah, go check him out. Can we guess who what dinner belongs to who? The healthy grilled salmon, healthy chicken and vegetables, <laughs> or the grilled chicken and cheese with double mashed potatoes? That's mine. Now we're really cheating, guys. Look at this. Vanilla bean cheesecake. I had to try it. I'm not going to have the whole thing. We're going to share it with my wife, who's filming, and Brendan over there. There's only one fork. No, I got three forks.